May 3rd. Vital Intercession. Praying always with all prayer and supplication in the Spirit. Ephesians 6, verse 18. As we go on in intercession, we may find that our obedience to God is going to cost other people more than we thought. The danger then is to begin to intercede in sympathy with those whom God was gradually lifting to a totally different sphere in answer to our prayers. Whenever we step back from identification with God's interest in others into sympathy with them, the vital connection with God has gone. We have put our sympathy, our consideration for them, in the way, and this is a deliberate rebuke to God. It is impossible to intercede vitally unless we are perfectly sure of God, and the greatest dissipator of our relationship to God is personal sympathy and personal prejudice. Identification is the key to intercession, and whenever we stop being identified with God, it is by sympathy, not by sin. It is not likely that sin will interfere with our relationship to God, but sympathy will. Sympathy with ourselves or with others, which makes us say, I will not allow that thing to happen. Instantly, we are out of vital connection with God. Intercession leaves you neither time nor inclination to pray for your own sad, sweet self. The thought of yourself is not kept out because it is not there to keep out. You are completely and entirely identified with God's interests in other lives. Discernment is God's call to intercession, never to fault finding.